Good afternoon, everybody. It's Josh here from Looking for Games. It's Friday, August 11th, 2023, and it's time for the Looking for Games weekly update. Jumping into this week's schedule, on Sunday, we kick off our next slate of Looking for Adventure as DM Paul returns to present Tarkus Operations. And then on Thursday, DM Joe presents the next chapter of Jammin' Out of Ravnica. And on Saturday, DM Dave presents the next chapter of Return to Neverwinter. Now, if you click on the link in the description below, you can not only see all of the available sessions, but you can also sign up to play. I should note, whenever it says a chapter, uh, basically this is a drop-in, drop-out format. So you're not locked into a, uh, a long campaign if for whatever reason you can't make it from week to week. You would just not get the experience that would, you have gained from being there. So even though it's a chapter segment or sometimes episodic type uh, uh, campaign, it doesn't mean that you can't get a full amount of enjoyment out of joining us for Looking for Adventure. For game night on Wednesday, nefarious forces are trying to take over the world, and once again, it's up to you to stop them. In Marvel Dagger, up to five players are going to mix and match their abilities and resources to try to defeat the forces of evil that threaten our globe. Complete missions and utilize your abilities and strengths to defeat enemies around the world as you head towards the ultimate final battle in Marvel Dagger. And if you're interested, we'll also have available Masters of the Universe Clash for Eternia. So that's Marvel Dagger and Masters of the Universe for Game Night. A couple of new things in stock we've got from Eggert Spiel Games, the third in the Great Great Western Trail. That's easy to say. New Zealand, uh, the Great the Great Western Trail trilogy. Uh, Great Western Trail, New Zealand. <laughs> Man, that's a lot of words. This time you'll be roaming the vast fields of New Zealand as a run holder using strategy and unique mechanics. And this will have all of the gameplay that you enjoyed from the original and more. And if you haven't had a chance to play Great Western Trail, we have the original in stock as well. So check those out. Great Western Trail and Great Western Trail, New Zealand. From Repos Productions, a unique take on dueling with champions. Three to eight players place bets on wacky categories and who would win, working your way around round by round until you get to the ultimate cha uh, champion. With tons of different categories and funny characters, there's lots of replay value in this party game from Repos Productions Champions. We've also got two new Everdell titles from Starling Games. First off, Everdell New Leaf an expansion to Everdell, where the bustling city has added its first new train station and brings with it all new crit critters, construction, and exciting events to draw visitors to the city. And then, a standalone title for kids and families, My Little Everdell, where the kids of the village gather resources and try to make up their best pretend cities. So, two new Everdell titles. And finally, a title that I have been looking forward to for quite a while from Red Raven Games, the makers of Above and Below and Near and Far comes another title with great, a great storytelling element. Lost at Sea, you'll try to make your way home by leveling up the abilities of your crew and making crucial choices all in the efforts to wake the gods that can get you back home. This is one I've had my eye on for a while, and I am super excited to be finally bringing it to LFG. And... I know I said just last week that we were discontinuing the item of the week, but I feel like that program still has merit to it, and it allows us to do special things like to celebrate the release of Great Western Trail New Zealand, because I needed another opportunity to say that series of words together. <laughs> we're giving you a chance to pick up both the original game and this new release at 20% off. So if you buy both titles, you're going to get 20% off. And this is an in-store only special, so you have to come by the store to get it. But it's a great chance to pick up a very cool strategy series, Great Western Trail, and Great Western Trail New Zealand. This week's item of the week in the queue. Now, I mentioned last week, and I've been telling you about Disney Lorcana as it is upcoming. Uh, release date is on the 18th, and we will be selling, celebrating it with an event starting at 7 o'clock. Entry is $60, and with that, you're going to not only get a random starter deck for you to uh, be able to play with, but also have an opportunity to win a box of boosters for this very cool new trading card game, 
Disney Lorcana, what they're calling Disney Lorcana, the first chapter, which would mean that they intend to have more chapters. So, <laughs> but uh, our first official Disney Lorcana event uh, will be on the 18th, which is next Friday at seven o'clock. Uh, we will post a link in the description below so that you can uh, register for that because I have a feeling that that's going to sell out pretty quickly. We're going to probably cap it off. Um, you know, I don't know what we're going to cap it off yet, uh, <laughs> but we probably should because uh, we don't want to oversell. Anyway, uh, so that is next Friday at 7 o'clock, Disney Lorcana. And finally, some new titles coming in very soon, including an expansion for Marvel Champions, which is next week. Uh, some more Star Wars Shatterpoint, which is also coming up next week. A uh, new title from Restoration Games, uh, their latest Kickstarter, Crossbows and Catapults, uh, as well as uh, Chemical Overload from... Uh, and uh, Tesseract from Smirk and Dagger. So that is our update for this week. If you enjoy our content, please like and subscribe. Feel free to tell others about us because as I always say, you shouldn't be the only one to suffer. Thank you for watching and have a great day.